Dave, and today we're going to be getting another Warframe. Today we're going to be building the Frost, and like with all the ones, first step is to actually get, you know, get the uh, Warframe uh, blueprint in question. So go ahead and, I think I just passed it, yeah, here it is. I already bought it, so if you want to purchase it, just hit the purchase button and uh, purchase the blueprint. And I'll just say, I really like this helmet thing, it's just... This is actually one of my favorite, you know, Warframes, the way it looks anyway. Obviously, I haven't played with it yet, so I don't know how it plays, but it looks awesome, as do most of the Warframes in the game. So, yes, of course, to uh, build it, uh, go over here, and, uh, okay, well, you get the Frost components on Mars by doing the assassination mission, which is um, Lieutenant Lilth, I think, or something like that. Anyway, he is a pain, uh, mainly hit him, okay, the way the way you defeat him, because it was very confusing for me, is it's not just you have to hit his backpack, you have to hit his backpack when he's down, um, and that's very, you have to hit his backpack to get rid of his shields, and after that his shields don't come back, um, but you have to make sure when he's down, after he's done his giant like axe throw attack thing, it's not just hitting him in the backpack all the time after his like axe head is stuck in the ground uh so yeah i'll give this a medium difficulty to get all the parts it took me about eight runs to get all of them you will be getting a lot of frost i got a ton of these and um frost you know anyway so yeah go ahead and uh build them and then of course wait 12 hours and i'll see you then Okay guys, it's been 12 hours and the frost components are complete. So go ahead and harvest these and then I will go ahead and start the construction of the frost. See you in three days. Okay, it's been three days and the uh, should be done. God, I hope it's done. It's done! Frost is done. Yes, another slot. I wish you'd just, you know, hit another slot, and then, you know, you wouldn't have to go back in there and, uh, you know, reselect it. That, that would be nice. That would be real nice. Let's go ahead and equip the frost, and, uh, unfortunately the helmet I was making isn't available yet. Oh, actually, let's, let's unequip the secondaries and stuff like that, and just... No, bad, go back. Okay, let's do a quick little, let's do that. Oh, wow, that has a lot of helmets. Okay, can you not hold the uh, thing like that? That'd be, what I'm actually making, and uh, yeah, that looks really awesome. I can't wait till it's done. That's a skin, it looks like a tuxedo, sort of. That looks, I don't like that. That's just weird. That's kind of cool looking. That's real cool looking. I like that a lot. That's, that's pretty cool. And that's also very cool. Okay, let's just do um, some oh, attachments. Of course, always got to attach this thing. I should really buy a different one. Um, then, of course, let's just change. Let's hit the uh, random color thing. No. No, that's too orange. That's really cool, actually. That looks pretty awesome. The only thing I would change is secondary. Maybe that, yeah. Oh yeah, that's awesome looking. That was fast. So yeah, uh, give me a couple minutes and I will show you, or give you a review of the, uh, of his abilities. See you in a sec. Okay, well, I've played quite a bit with uh, this character and, uh, oh moderate amount so let's go over its abilities and what i think about it and give it a potato rating okay well overall i would say this is actually a really good warframe uh, it looks really good and its abilities all seem to be pretty good uh, first off its passive ability is that when there's a chance that uh, when you get hit by an enemy's melee it might uh freeze the enemy which is it doesn't happen very often i can tell so it's it's good. I'll just leave it at that. Uh, freeze is first rank ability, or first ability. Uh, basically, it's just you have to look at someone and you use the ability and you freeze them. Pretty basic. 
Uh, Ice Wave, this one is probably my least favorite out of all of them. It just creates a single wave of, of ice in one direction. And it just, it deals damage obviously in that direction, but it doesn't seem very useful. And it's the one I use the least. Uh, Snow Globe is incredibly useful. It, you basically can, it creates a giant orb of uh, ice or icy air. And uh, just you being inside of it protects you and any enemies that go inside of it uh, take damage and freeze. Very ha handy. And then uh, Avalanche is probably one of the best um, just area effect ones I've seen so far on a uh, Warframe. Pretty much as described, it's pretty much just a bunch of ice in your area. So it's very effective. It's probably, one of, again, one of, probably one of the best ones. Probably even better uh, uh, ranked up. I haven't used it all that much, but it is very effective. Um, so yeah, overall, I'd say the Warframe... <laughs> I'd say Frost is a very good Warframe. Um, I can't really think of any... The only thing I don't particularly like is, again, the second ability doesn't seem all that useful, but I'm not going to degrade it just because of one of its abilities. Uh, overall, I think I would give it... Let me think. Um, mm, yeah, give it 8 point... No, 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 just screw that. At 9 potatoes. 9 Lenny Face potatoes out of 10. Um... So yeah, if you've uh, enjoyed this how to get video, please consider like favoriting, favoriting and subscribing. And uh, yeah, I will see you in the next video. Oh, almost forgot. If there's any Warframes in particular you want me to do next, please leave a comment down below. And we'll see you later.